Hey guys, welcome back to Farming Simulator 17 with me, Brad M73, and it's moving into nighttime here on the farm. And let's see, what do I have to do today? Uh, we've got the new Coon pack out, the Coon DLC. So that's pretty cool. Okay, so everything's fertilized. Uh, nothing needs plowing. And do we already get everything planted? We might have already got everything planted because I think I've got corn, wheat, barley, and soybeans down here. So yeah, we got a little bit of everything this episode. Um, so I guess let's see. Whoops! Why didn't I start off in that uh, tractor? Uh, there we go. <clears throat> so we'll start off in this guy. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna fast forward time. And we'll, we'll get him uh, backed around so that uh, he's all ready to go. And uh, while, while time is fast forwarding, we'll take a quick look at the Coon Pack. Now, if you want to see everything that's in the, uh, the new Coon DLC, um, I actually have a video f specifically for that. So go check that out. Um, but let's see here. I th the best way to look at it would be to go to the uh, all the brands category and just scroll down until we find Kuhn or Kuhn, which is right here. Kuhn, how, however it's spelled. Um, like in, I think it's a German brand or or from that area of Europe, and so I'm pretty sure they would pronounce it Kuhn, uh, or Kuhn, something like that, um, or just Kuhn. Uh, so, you know, here in the United States, I would pronounce it Kuhn. So some people have messaged me saying that I'm saying it wrong, but I think it kind of just depends on where you're from, maybe. I don't know. Uh, so we've got the uh, the new Coon header, uh, the Merge Max 902. This is a wind rower. I know it doesn't look like one. This I'm actually really looking forward to trying out. I think that's going to be really cool. Um, the DC 401, and I'm actually, well, shoot, I won't even need this yet because um, I don't have to plow anything yet. But I think after this next harvest, uh, we will need to plow. So I will look into doing that. Let's see, we've got... Uh, a couple, these are narrower um, cultivators, both at four meters. This one's really cool. It's just, it's narrow. Uh, I, I would, I would like to use it otherwise. Um, oh, oh, e, ah, ooh, ooh, ah, e, e, ah, ah, ooh, 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 ah. I need to check. <laughs> ah, slow down. Wait, wrong one. What's going on here? Oh yeah, here we go. Uh, fruit type, soil comp, fertilized. So, yeah, we need to do, oh man. Uh, I guess we'll we're gonna need to do some fertilization on, the, on some of these fields. So I'm I I don't know. We're gonna see how far I can get with this. Hopefully, I'm gonna be able to do the whole field. Um, I do want to get the the coon sprayer, the, the little mini sprayer. Um, so I might actually sell this Amazon. As much as I like it, I might end up selling it. Okay, so let's see here. Yeah, we got the dark blue there. That's what we want to see. Um, so let's kind of go to some of the different tractors. I love playing at night sometimes. <laughs> it's easy on the eyes. No, but I actually do like the, uh, you know, that it's dark and I don't know. Maybe I'm just crazy. Okay. Get all of our equipment out here, get our strobes on. And, OK, 
Okay, there he goes. What other... Okay, so he's there. Oh, here we go. Did I get... Okay, yeah. So we need to get him back down to the farm. Have him pick up a weeder and, and start weeding. Probably have him do the bigger fields down at the bottom. Not that it really makes too much of a difference, but um, I don't know. We'll see. Oh, another thing. Last uh, After the last episode, I actually did the uh, the job on field number five. So that's why I actually have like a, like a pretty big chunk of money. And also keep in mind, we also lost about ten or $12,000 here at midnight. So I, I think I had something like up in the 40,000s, something like that. Um, and I can't remember, I don't think I paid off any of the loan. I think I just kind of set up my course play, had it do the job on field five, and then, you know, like when I came back, we were all finished and and it took several hours to do. So that's kind of a nice reason to have course play and learn how to use it. Um, unfortunately, you know, the console players, you guys are, are not going to be able to use course play because it does require scripts. I know I've mentioned it before. Some people have hated on me for mentioning it, but that's just kind of the way it is, unfortunately, for you guys. So I want to go down and get him set up doing, let's see, field maybe 24. And off we go. Okay, so next up, let's see. I want to uh, see about getting a new tractor, but I want one that has a front loader on it. No, let's see, this is 210 horsepower. Which is like the same as this. What? Okay, so we can get a front loader. Uh, we might as well go, f wait, <laughs> 190,000. Yeah, I see, I just don't think, I, th I don't think that even, even if we go with the, uh, well, let's look here. Ooh, we got 152 pigs. That's my, that's my minimum number right now that I want is 152, <clears throat> um, finances. So we've got... A uh, hundred thirty-five thousand dollar loan. So even if we borrow, let's just borrow all three hundred thousand. Oh, this is going to be painful. We've got a hundred and ninety-one thousand dollars. So yeah, so it's basically going to take us the entire loan to get a new tractor, and I kind of would like a Fent as well. We could also get the front loader attachment for this. Um, but even to get the 724, we're looking at 202,000. And I can't, oh no, I, I think we actually can go back later. And like if we buy like the 716, I think we actually can go back as long as we buy the, um, the, the vehicle workshop, I think we can actually upgrade it later. I think. It's been a while. Like, like back when I was doing all the live stream when the game first came out, I was playing around with that a lot, and now I've now I've forgotten. Um, all right, let's so let's look. We've got the voucher in series. This is a front loader, but it's just the engine setup. Let's see what we can get it up to. 185 horsepower. That's not too bad. And it's only 139,000. And we still have a Valtra. Or, you know, we've, we've got one of the newer, um, you know, Valtra tractors. Ugh. 
see here. Ooh, in the front. Actually, I really like this Fent 300 Vario too. So if you do that, got 313, but see, it's only 138 horsepower. But what do we have right now? We have, have these guys. So these are 145. So yeah, that would that wouldn't even be as much horsepower. So I think let's see, what is this one? 185 horsepower. This is probably going to be a pretty good tractor, you know, to upgrade. And decisions, decisions. And we've got the Voucher T series. To do this for 170,000. I uh, let's see, let's see what we've got. Well, let's see what's let's see what we've got going on the map first. Uh, Uh oh. Tank is empty. Oh. oh man, he was almost finished too. The thing that I really don't like doing, though, is, like, when we get, like, one of the things I want to do is I want to sell the, um, the Amazon, uh, sp uh, spreader, or the, not the spreader, the, um, sprayer, and we, I also want to sell one of these tractors, but I think that I might, I think I might sell the the small. Let's see where are we at? Where are we at here? Okay, so he was coming up this way. But yeah, he would have been finished. Darn it! Okay. Eh. I think I might end up selling this little guy. Oh, cool. It's still folding a hop. Okay, so I kind of want to look at the field down here and see where it needs to be. And hopefully he'll turn, he'll turn back around and come back down. So I think I'm going to say goodbye to the little New Holland here. You've been a good worker, little guy. So, wait a second, um, sprayers. So yeah, now we've got these two. So it's gonna, this, these two are gonna cost us 38,000 <clears> for these two. Cause I wanna get the front tank too. Not to mention, I wanna get a fertilizer tank. Cause we are gonna need some fertilizer. Oh, another thing too I wanted to see. Uh, let's see, this is what we have now. So this is what, 15 meters wide. And this one is 21 meters wide. So that'll help too in, um, you know, helping speed things up. So I think it's a good purchase. We got our Amazon for what? And when did I buy that? Did I just buy that last episode or the episode before? We haven't had this for very long. I kind of feel like it's been a waste of money, um, but that's just kind of the way it is. But, you know, we got to move forward. We got to get better equipment. And uh, this episode is the episode in which I'm going to do that. Oh, yeah. So we will head back there. We got our other guys working hard or maybe hardly working. Um, Uh-oh. We've got the big weeder. He's done. So we'll come back to we'll come back to him as soon as I get up here. So 
So, oh, man. I guess what's going to... We're really going to be dependent on which tractor we decide to buy. Well, we, we, ha we want to buy the Coon equipment. And then, you know, beyond that, it's going to depend on which tractor... Or how much money we have left over as to which tractor we can afford to buy. Is that any, any of this making sense? It's, you know, I have to remember, it's me, so chances are, no, it does not make sense. Okay. So we're gonna get, okay, we're gonna get 21,000, so that's pretty good. So we'll get a, a decent amount back for that. Um, let's see. No, I don't want tractors yet. We want sprayers. So we want to get the front tank. Ears. And we'll get the Dallas. Go. Man, this would so this would so go good with um let's see which with with like the stair. Like if we bought the stair tractor, it would like be color coded. Or even the Lindner. 82 get three more horsepower for that. Not really Looking at a Zetter, or Zetor, Zetter, whatever. Um, I always like the Hurleymans too. It's just like they don't really color coordinate very well. So I guess we could go with like, we still have 170,000. We're going to have more once we sell the other tractor. Um... If we get this, the main color is going to be white. Rim color. Could be like a dark red or something like that. Um, Let's see here. We're going to leave this other tractor up here. Let's, let's tab around. Okay, he's finished. We're actually going to be able to get this, this done pretty quickly, I think. Think being the key word here. Okay, so he's gonna go that way. Um We'll have him run up and do was it fields nineteen? Like, I, I kind of never want to ever buy Field 16 again. <laughs> <clears throat> it's square fields for me. Um. Okay, so back over here. Eh. All right, we'll just visit the shop, I guess. Well, everybody, say goodbye to our New Holland, Um, whatever the number is. I can't even see it because it's all muddy. 8340 or 3340? <laughs> it's so muddy, I can't tell. Uh, Alright, so we'll only get 15,000 for that. Wow, okay. Oh man, we could almost afford the, uh, the better voucher. Alright, here goes, guys. Um, we're going to do the voucher T-series in white with the front loader attacher and we'll just we'll just leave it at uh, white for right now yes and we'll get our flashlights on so here we go we got our tanks we got our sprayers got our new voucher nice Looks all looks all technologically futuristic, but it's just a lot of plastic. Oh, it has a dinky horn on it. Okay. We're gonna hook up our tanks. Now what I'm going to do is we're going to buy, let's 
see here. I think I'm gonna need like I think I'm gonna need two of these. Let's let's just fill one up and see what happens. <clears throat> we got the front and the rear tanks gonna fill up. Might even take more than two. Or it might not even take wait a second here. Something something is does not feel right. Wait, no. Okay. Sprayers. See, the front tank is 1,500. But this one holds 1,300, so we should have way more. Let's, let's go up here. Oh, there we go. Okay, there. that's better. I was like, what the heck? It's like it wasn't... Uh, working there. Alright, we'll buy another one of these. There we go. That's better. I'm actually surprised that the rear tank holds so little, but it still holds more than the Amazon, I think. Once we get this uh, spraying, we can actually go and check and see the Kuhn Deltas. Or the Kuhn. Kuhn. I... You know, it, it's very difficult to find, um, like, actual manufacturer videos from Kuhn on YouTube. But I did find one several months ago, and it basically said that, um, it, it kind of pronounced it like I've been pronouncing it, like Kuhn. But I'm not going to say it, because I'm, you know, I'm going to just say it the American way, which would be Kuhn. So, there we go. Deal with it. Hopefully you guys are dealing with it okay. Alright, so. Here is the field in which we want to spray our nutritious liquids. Get it kind of lined up here. And there we go, we got the... Oh, and we can also do this, wait. Oh no, I can't do it now, because I'm... <laughs> I've hired the worker. Okay, um... Field 19... See this? They, they, they do not do the last little strip here, so it's like you always have to do these things manually now. Way to mess it up, giants. And let's see, helper E is on field 14. Um, so yeah, we just have to feel, uh, finish up field 14 and 23, we'll be done. And we'll still have plenty of time and you know to, to get started on the harvest. Unfortunately now, whoa, hello. Okay, let's put this back down. Ah. Holy cow, he's like cruising. Um, yeah. Oh, I th you know what that? I think the uh, patch may have reset that. Okay, so we're going to go across. See, how are we doing on price right now? Crop, whoops, wrong way. Wrong direction. So we've got, for sunflower, we don't have anything. And all the prices are crappy, though canola is going up. E barley and wheat are going up. Corn is going who knows where. Got a decent amount of maple field mill for corn. Actually pretty, not a bad price. I think I'm gonna be able to fast forward. Man, look at the train. Okay, we gotta we gotta do something about these trains. So wait a second. No, 
need to go like 22. There we go. There we go. Now they're now they are going their correct speeds. Okay, so wow. This actually gets a really good spread. This is only like the third spray up the field, but we only have this kind of a narrow patch right here. I don't know if you guys can see this. So I don't want to waste all that spray coming back down there just for that. So we're just going to get to the end here and then we'll um, go ahead and fire him. As the, the sun begins to rise here. Okay. Kind of let him finish folding up. And we'll just go down. We'll do this one. I guess we'll do this manually. And I really, really, really wish that we would get some decent... Uh, pricing though on our crops um, and we're gonna we're gonna do basically just like a mass uh, I, I might do the one field in corn like I always do but I, I think I'm gonna do everything else in sunflowers uh, for this next harvest because we haven't really done sunflowers yet Ooh, it's like froggy this morning foggy or froggy when I was a little kid I always used to say froggy because because frogs <laughs> <clears throat> I don't see uh, <clears throat> I don't see frogs where I live too much anymore like when I was a kid like where our house was used to see them all the time but I don't really see them around here very often anymore it's kind of sad uh, oh great it had to do this Nope, nope. Let's see. Nope, you're getting fired. Okay, I cannot, for the life of me, tell at all where the next... And of course, you know what else? Because it switched to the... Wait a second here. Yeah. We need to be over a little bit further, I think. Probably more like this. All right, let's slow down time now that we've got... Um... Oh, look at this tractor. It's like all futuristic and looks really nice. Very nice, very nice. We did that field, and it only took like 12% of the, the fertilizer out of there, so I'm pleased with that. Oh, let's look inside the Valtra. What? Why is there like a rear view mirror right there? I don't understand. Um, well, anyways. <laughs> what the heck was that? It was like four different lights. Um, all right, let's go ahead and drop this here. Oh, no. And we'll damage our brand new piece of equipment here right off the bat. That's always nice, Brad. Uh, bonk that, too. Okay. All right, so he's finished... Uh, have him park this weeder up here at the f uh, field or at the, the shelter. Now, 
Now, I have the sneaking suspicion that when we start doing the next harvest... Why did he... Uh, did he... What? Why is, what's he doing back here? Did he, like, turn around? Don't turn around! I think we gotta go down here. It's really tough. It's like you, it's, you really have to zoom out to see like what's been fertilized and what hasn't been. It can be di very difficult to see sometimes. All right. So we're going to fast forward time all the way this time. Because all I have to do is just the little end of the, end of the field down here. And we're going to be done, and hopefully we will be able to harvest relatively soon. All right. All right, so we'll head back to the farm. Every, everybody's done, I'm pretty sure. Yes. Here comes the train again. Training on my... F no, I don't know. I, could, I couldn't think of anything. Why do I always sing Eurythmics? Why is it always Eurythmics? Because I guess that's the song that's always like, here comes the <laughs> whatever again. And we shall, um, get this guy out of the way. So we've got one tractor down. We still have to get rid of, we have to devise an evil plan to get, whoops, to get these other old tractors sold. Man, hard mode is definitely hard. Okay, there we go. Where is... There he is. Oh, great. Oh, wonderful. And now we get the great demand for sunflower. <laughs> that really sucks. Because I don't think we didn't we didn't plant any sunflower. I'm pretty sure. Nope. So what I want to do here, I'm just going to drop this off for the Valtra. Hopefully the Valtra can use that. Man, it, the Valtra looks so big. I don't know. We're going to go see. <gasps> Great. Uh, uh, canola. <clears throat> right at, oh my God, way up there, huh? Oh, man. Wait, what's the great demand for? Whoop. Prices. What? A great demand if... Are you... F oh, my God. I'm going to... I'm going to... I am going to take a screenshot of this. Let's see how, do I, do I hit print screen or F12? Okay, F12, I saved the screenshot. I'm gonna send this screenshot to Giants 
because that is stupid. Like, why would you even have a great demand for, for like, half the price, almost, that everyone else is selling it for? I mean, come on, guys. You guys can do way better than that. Uh, please don't tell, please tell me that this is going to work on here. Yay, it does. Okay, let's, uh, let's take a, gosh darn it. I got this, like, n n like, piece of paper as a mouse pad, but it just ain't working out. Oh, let's see, finance is aminal, so 67. Ooh, they've got, they're really dirty. So we could sell 17 pigs. And be where we want to be as far as like all of our pig growth and everything goes. All right, let's speed time back up again. And hopefully, we will um, be ready to harvest here in just a moment. So we're going to sell 16, we're going to sell the, our pig, well, we're going to sell all of our pigs above 150 right now. And that's going to help us, because we're going to, we are going to need to really bring down the, um, the loan. Because I have never had, you know, I, I don't know what kind of interest we're going to be paying on a daily basis. I got a, I got a feeling it's going to be fairly ridiculous, though. So I don't know. We'll see. We'll pick all this up. Biggs, you like spit half your corn out. I'm gonna start stop feeding you guys corn. Okay, so cleanliness is going to be good. Corn's back up a little bit. Let's um, let's go right over here. Whoops, into our pig selling. So, do we get how much do we get? So, essentially, we'll get a thousand per pig. So we've got what? Whoops. Uh, we've got one hundred and sixty-nine. Wait a second here. I want to slow down. Wait. Oh, I was going to say that that field is like halfway grown. So, all right, back to the pigs. <clears throat> So yeah, we've got 169 unless we tick up to 170 here real quick. So that's going to be, um, you know, 19 pigs. So that'll be 19,000. That ain't too bad. Um, I kind of want to go, I kind of want to keep moving time forward until our crop has grown. I always end up doing this where I'm doing crop or I'm doing harvests at night. Who is do that? <clears throat> I'm hoping at 1900 that, that it'll cycle. Oh man, it's like sunset already. Come on, you guys, give me some. Give me some corn. Uh, <clears throat> we probably got an extra pig or two out of that. So 171. All right, so we're gonna sell. Um, we're gonna sell down to 150 pigs right here. So that'll be 21,000, and we'll confirm that. Yes, we got 33,000. Awesome. Still not harvesting, huh? Or still not growing, I mean. So 
So that's a pretty nice chunk of change. Hold on, let's get up. Let's get past twenty hours. And it's gonna get dark again. Wah. Wait, the, did the I'm gonna like ha, I'm gonna screen and see plant growth normal. No, I've had it on fast for you guys. Off, off. What the heck? Oh no no no, that's that's right. Um, stopping breaking. I would have swore I had fat plant growth on fast though. It will just sit. Oh shoot. Because we're going to be harvesting at night. And I don't like harvesting at night at all. On a positive note, we're going to have more pigs to sell. I can tell you that right now. We already have two more pigs we can sell. Um, Speaking of pigs we can sell, though, we are going to need... Bad gommet. I need to pick up the rest of the corn. Come on, go. And I think we've got to fill up the straw. Let's uh, hit the hit him with some water here too, while we're right here. It ha okay, there we go. Finally, we're going to be doing a midnight corn harvest, I guess. Um, where's my... Oh, I was in it the, f the whole time and I couldn't see. Alright, so we'll just pull him out. Just to get him ready for the corn harvest. Oh, I love this tractor. It has power! You know what? I didn't end up going through the rest of the coon pack for you guys. <laughs> Whoops. Ah, we'll go through it here in a second. I can't believe I forgot. No, of course I can believe I forgot. Are you kidding me? It's me, remember? Um, let's see here. So we've got coon, 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 coon. Um, let's see. What did we get up to? We got up to the, um, the wind rower here. We also have, this is a plow, the DC 401. And I'm really looking forward to using this as plows. Um, we also have the, um, oh, we've got, no, no, no. I think I talked about that. Yeah. The two, um, cultivators. We also have the disco lander. This is a cultivator that does the cover crop as well. So I may consider buying this um, because of the way they've changed the game. Um, let's see, what's next? The Some Cedars, we've got the Espro 3000. Uh, we also have the TF-1500 uh, and the BTF-4000. Now these two go together. This is like the cedar portion. This is the like where you actually uh, carry the seeds. So this goes on the front of your tractor. This goes on the back. And you, you can see that in my Coon video. Uh, we also have the um, the Planter 3R, so it's 5.4 meters. And actually, I wanted to compare this to, uh, which was it? This one. So this is 6 meters. So the Vader stat still is slightly wider. Um, and then, of course, the Horsh is, like, way wider. So, you know, there, there's not, like, a huge benefit to buying that. But, you know, if you want some new equipment, then there you go. Um, you've got the um, the Axis 40.2. This is just a standard fertilizer spreader. Nothing, you know, no frills. 24 meters. I think that's the same. Is that the same as the Amazon? Whoops. Is that the same as the Amazon? Fertilizer spreader. Or the Bridal. Yes, it would be. Yeah, 24 meters. We don't have the old the Amazon spreaders anymore. 
I forgot. I forgot. Um, then we have the um, the PF fifteen hundred and the the Deltas. The, these are the two that I just bought. You also have the Metris, which is like the really super wide thirty six meter uh, sprayer. You've got the GDM forty four eleven. This is just a mower. You know, it folds out to the side. The SW uh, forty fourteen. This is actually a square baler. Uh, the LSB 1290D, this is just your standard, uh, I'm sorry, the, the SW4014, this is a square bale wrapper, I'm sorry. The LSB 1290D, this is actually the square baler. Uh, the FBP3135, this is actually a round baler, but um, you can't see it, but it actually wraps the bales for you. And then we've got the Coon VB2190. This is actually a mod. You can get it from the mod store. No, you know, nothing to get too excited about there. All right. <clears throat> Looks like our corn is almost full here. So let's go down and get that. We'll keep <clears throat> keep driving, keep things moving. You what? Eh, no. Of course I don't because I f because fail. All right, there we go. All right, so we've got about 15 minutes or so left, maybe a little bit less. Uh, let's see. Oh. Let's see, so we got 53. I need to look at the map because I want to see. Wow, soil composition. So we still don't have to fertilize. Is this this does not need plowing yet? That's good. That's very good. Oh, all right, we can decouple that. So I think these guys are going to need some water. Oh, you know what else I could do for some more money? Oh, that's right. Nope. We are going to have to take this guy back down to the other... Um, to the main farm. Because when we start harvesting all the wheat and barley, we're going to need to pick up all the straw. For the pigs. We're going to need to get the little pottinger filled up again. Especially because we don't have any square balers. Hello? Oh, no, it's going to rain. Well, actually, that won't be too bad. This voucher actually feels like it's pretty beefy. I gotta, I gotta admit, I'm pretty impressed. There's our Massey Ferguson over there. Okay. Now I will need the uh, I will need the voucher to be back on fertilizer duty because we're gonna have to spray the fields. We're gonna pop that off there. And then we'll, uh, connect this up. And finally, connect him up. Now, another thing I want to do, um, and I'll, you know, we'll do that here in a moment, is I want to fast forward time 
to the morning before we start uh, seeding again. Um, so we'll do that here. Okay. <clears throat> um, let's see. I want to see like what other jobs are available. Let's see. Nothing here. Well, nothing massive. I guess no harvesting jobs. These are probably all, all going to be like spraying. Oh, wow. Look at that. We don't get much money, but that's kind of a cool mission. Let's see. Let's go down here. Yeah, fertilizing on field number 20. Ooh, wow, look at that. 88, 88 minutes. This would probably take about maybe, let's see, 88 minutes. That's going to be one hour and 28 minutes, right? And 36 seconds. Um, That would really probably only, it would probably wouldn't even take an hour to do this even with course play. So I might actually consider doing that um, with course play after this uh, this episode is done. Um, yeah, because we've only got a few minutes left. We're going to have to do everything else um, off screen. Or actually, no. What I can do, I can finish this field up. Whoops. There we go. I kind of want to sell the pickup truck too because let's be honest I haven't used it in ep many many episodes and it's just sitting there costing me money like all of my other equipment I'm actually using except for that darn thing so I think I think that might be the last thing I'll do this episode what do you guys think man this one field almost completely filled up the the corn harvester let's take one let's see we got four more pig. We can get four more thousand dollars there. Um, let's do that. Oh, shoot. Oh, now I remember why I kept the, the pickup truck, because it's up here at the pigs. But I still think it costs us a lot of money just to sit there and do nothing. Um, so, whoops, no, R. There we go. One, two, three, four... There's another 4,000. So see how see how we can start raking money in with these pigs. Now, what I really want to do is get them up to about 200. Uh, but I think we still kind of need some more equipment in order to be able to really take advantage of that. Um, we also want to pay back some of the balance. So let's do 20,000 right there. Let's do another 5,000. So we did 25,000. We repaid back. Actually, we're going to want to pay it down as much as possible to mitigate our loan interest. Um, so, yeah. There we go. Man, it, it, I'm starting to get kind of, like with the new equipment, I, th I, th I think we're really going to start making some headway here. Um, let's go. Why do I keep doing this? Uh, what's field 31? What do we got to do here? Spraying. So that's another just, you know, spray mission. Um, that's actually like a decent chunk of change, though. That ain't too bad. Um, what do we have on field 27? Spraying, fertilizing, yeah. Um, field 26 is also <laughs> like everything is fertilizing. Field 22, ooh, look at that. You have to get to use the Amazon. 
But I think the one that's going to make us the most money, let's see, what was this one again? Yeah, that one's nothing special. Field number 20 here. So I'm going to do this one off screen. I'm not going to like, you know, time lapse it or anything. I just don't have enough time to um, right now because it would definitely take a lot of time. Oh, wait a second. 28. Yeah, we want to do the the more expensive one. Or the, you know, the one that pays out more, I mean. Yeah, yeah. You guys know what I'm talking about. Um, are we going to have enough room in here to cap off the, uh, the trailer? I cannot believe we got a full field load. Do I usually get a full field load out of this? I don't think so. I do not think so. All right, so I guess I'm going to keep the pickup truck a little bit longer... Ah, what? Man, I really took like a massive frame rate hit there. I don't know what that was all about. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna top it off in no time. Yep, that's topped off. We still have some more corn left in there. Let's just uh, unload this and we'll call it a day. Um, again, I'm gonna do the uh, the other um, farming job off screen, and then we will come back in the next episode and get everything else harvested and kind of see where we're at um, and, and start planting all of the, uh, the the sunflowers. I'm really looking forward to a big, huge sunflower harvest. Um, we still don't have like super great pricing. Oh, we're, we're maxed out on corn there, 100,000. Um, we've got some fairly decent canola pricing. We could, we could take a load of Denton Bakery. Um, also check this out. The, um, the soybean prices are starting to come up, so that's good. Um, hopefully we can get these up over a thousand and, uh, and then we'll be able, you know, that if, if we can get that over a thousand, we'll be able to easily dump a hundred, you know, we'll easily be able to get a hundred thousand bucks just like that. So I guess in the meantime, I'm going to take the rest of the corn up to the pigs and then, uh, we'll take the, uh, we'll take the rest of this on down to the uh, the mill there in the kind of the center. We'll just dump it off there because that's where you know we've got a bunch of extra room to sell or to store for free. Yay! All right, guys. Well, that will be it for this episode. Thank you so much for hanging out with me once again, and please do not forget to hit that like and subscribe button. I am Bradham73. We'll see you back for more Farming Simulator 17 very soon. Bye for now, guys.